Bismillah, uh, Salatu Wassalam, Rasulullah. Okay, we'll continue. Uh, uh, I think for today uh, we will talk about the reduction, how to write uh, uh, the memory. We talked uh, about that uh, before offline, uh, and we have some point, some idea, some uh, rectification to do uh, in this regard. <coughs> in this regard. Uh, okay, I think you can see that. Uh, I gave you a shared link. Did it work for you? I gave you a shared link in the email. In the email, okay. Well, I can show you. I can show you. لا مازال ايه باسكو انا بديتكم في هذه الموديفيكاسيون اللي ديال مارك Okay, there is no problem. We can wait. Anyway, it, yes. you a, it, was, it was a shared link. This is. Uh, yes, yes, I'm seeing the email. Okay. Yes. One minute. Is it working? I'm waiting the network. Okay. Oui, être là. Oui, ça va. Ah, voilà. No, sir, it's not working. Yeah, the shaded link is not working. You can't. Uh... Oh, yes, uh, there you... is an mm -hmm. indication. Sorry, an error has occurred. Microsoft OneDrive. Uh, do you have a Microsoft account? No, I don't. I just have uh, uh, the applications. Okay. Word and PowerPoint. Okay, then I should give uh, uh, send you the uh, the file uh, offline. I will send the, the file uh, through uh, th through uh, Discord. Okay. Uh, how can we do? I don't remember. I need to save it. 
file. I guess it was a download of something like this. Okay, you have the, uh, uh, the file. Uh, did you get it? One minute, I will see. Okay. Uh, no, not yet. Uh, there is no fun. In, in Discord. I said it's yes, in Discord. Oh, there is no, there is nothing on Discord in the uh, general. It is visible yes. for me. Chapter one. I can't see it. There is no one. Uh, are you sure? No, normally, it's uh, it's visible. Normally, it's uh, it's past. You have to check again. You have to check in the general sec section. Take text your sec uh, section. Yes. No. What do you have on textual section? Okay. The last element. What was the last element? Okay, sorry, sorry. It was my fault. I didn't say it. Uh, now it's... Uh, 
I, I didn't say it to the... Now, now uh, I think it's, uh, it's okay. Yes, yes, it's okay now. Yes, I got it, sir. Okay, can we start? Yes. Okay, this means that uh, we have some, we have uh, some remarks, some notes uh, to uh, to the to, to this chapter. The first one, the the, uh, the remarks are uh, colored with a red color. You can see them. Yes. Uh, for instance, in the first yes. uh, in the first page. Uh, we have the uh, in the introduction. I suggest to use the Arabic numbers, uh, not the Roman numbers, in a header. Normally, okay. Uh, normally, uh, this is specific. This is specific. Some uh, uh, anyway. In uh, our university, we use the numeric. Uh, we don't use the uh, the Roman numbers. The, Ro the Roman numbers are uh, only used, I guess. In the in the numeration of the chapters, I guess. In the in the uh, how we call that? I don't remember how we call that. Table of contents in table of the material. Table of contents is the only one. Uh, uh, I'm not sure. Yes. I'm, I'm not sure about that. Uh, even that. Even in the. Uh, no, I, I, I was mistaken. Excuse me one, one minute. I will check. Yes. I will check something. Uh, where is my. Uh, okay. Yes, the uh, the Roman the Roman numeration is not is not used at all. It's not used at all. It is used in the page numbers of the first pages, like table contents, uh, figures list, table list. You can see that on the. Uh, you can, uh, yes, uh, yes, I got you. Yes, we don't have uh, in the uh, numeration the uh, the Roman numbers. We use only the Arabic numbers, and I think I'm not sure uh, 100 percent. I think uh, this is what we use in our university. I think it's, it is a standard. Anyway, anyway, uh, you will use uh, an Arabic. Uh, the Arabic number. Uh, the second note: paragraphs should be aligned with the page limits, not shifted like below. I talked about this. This space, this space should be eliminated. Yes, you have told me that. Uh, what? You have told me that. Yes, we, we talked about that. We talked about that before. Yes. Uh, we, we should get this line, the, all the text. Upon this line, upon last uh, line, uh, you have a very good reduction, yeah. uh, reduction here. But I have some uh, success, success, uh, success, uh, some uh, suggestion to uh, some modification to do here. I will talk about uh, that uh, after about the introduction and the conclusion. Uh, the next one 
is uh, the next remark in page uh, was in page uh, uh, which page page two page two yes in page two we have the figure uh, the figure you write a figure one one point one and dash block diagram for combination seconds i think uh, you should use a semicolon semicolon the point semicolon instead of yes. the yes it, it's uh, it's relative uh, to the standards of our university if i uh, remember well i don't know if they changed it or not we don't use that we uh i have a he a here a, 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 a thesis and in figure we should use uh, some economies if i remember if i i if saw you, uh, that, that i saw a next thesis book uh, like what? 223 uh -huh. they used the the dash uh who students yeah students uh, yeah the, the students can make mistakes and the uh, yes but this mm -hmm. other students it's like the final result yes it was the final result. even though even though i can tell you i uh, the dash is never used like this but may maybe the students uh, did a mistake but you can check any uh, any th 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 thesis you can you can in, in the uh, in the uh, in the figure you have uh, to make semicolons it's obvious yeah the, 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 we make a lot of uh, papers uh, journals papers and in the for the final project the thesis we use always semicolons. You have to use semicolons. I'm yeah, sure about that. Yes, I will use the semicolons. Uh, semicolons are the uh, the standard. And uh, yes. Okay. The next one. Uh, yes, semicolons. Yes, semicolons. The next one is uh, two short paragraphs okay. could be added, uh, like a point uh, with the previous one. For these uh, two, uh, two lines, we have uh, the n input va uh, variables. Uh, comes from the external sources we have here uh, two uh, we can say we have a two cent, uh, two a, par a two small paragraph these two two small yes. paragraph could be added here could be like, like a fourth point for instance it's better it would be better yes is it clear or uh, should i explain more uh, what do you mean the uh, the meaning of the text Yes. No, 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 the the input variable. No, the text is, is very clear. The text is very clear. It's uh, it's expressive. Uh, it's clear. You can understand. It's uh, we can clearly understand what I am talking about. The uh, in, in this part, uh, in this uh, remarks are prim primarily uh, focused on the format. You know, on the thesis, you have two two aspects. We have the format. And we have the, the and we have the explanation. I'm talking about the format in this part. Uh, the explanation. I uh, will talk about the uh, something uh, some about the uh, the reduction after. And about the format, we, uh, you have to understand that the the, the the paragraph have to get some number of lines. Uh, we can we, we can't create a paragraph, for instance, for for uh, from one line or two. It's too short. It's too short, and the paragraph cannot uh, also be too big. For, for, for instance, a paragraph of ten or uh, fifteen lines is too big. You have uh, at some point to yes. subdivide it. Yes, the, the, those some rules on how to write the paragraph. Paragraphs. Yes. Okay, let's continue. We have uh, uh, sequential logic. Don't forget tabulation in the beginning of each paragraph. Each paragraph should begin with this uh, tabulation. We also talked about this the last time. About the tabulation. Yes. 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 You have to add tabulation. Yes. Uh, about those three paragraphs too. We have uh, the first paragraph, this one. The second one, this one. 
and the third one with also four lines, four or five lines. They should be reassembled together to form one unique paragraph. This formation of paragraphs is not uh, suited for, uh, for the thesis. Uh, do you understand me? Yes, yes, I... Uh, it's prefer I, I wrote, it's preferable to merge those three paragraphs in one uh, larger one. They are too small, they are too small. You can't write a paragraph like this. This, uh, uh, the, the par in the reduction, the paragraph contains a main idea. This idea should be presented on, uh, like, uh, let's say, the minimum five lines, the maximum 15 or 20 lines in each paragraph. The structure of the, uh, the paper of the, uh, sorry, of the synthesis uh, should be uh, uh, constructed like this. Yes. Okay, uh, we have uh, uh, here, don't forget spaces uh, and tabulation between paragraphs. Uh, the same, uh, we have uh, like, like, like this, for instance. Between uh, the first and the second paragraph, there is no space. The paragraph should be spaced. You have to make a space uh, uh, between each paragraph. Yes. Yes, you have to add spaces. Uh, we have uh, uh, trigger pulse or signals is applied, uh, which will cause uh, this definition. Ah, you have uh, some error here. In the uh, reduction, you have. Uh, Where? Uh, let's see this. Uh, the definition of. Uh, uh, in this paragraph, you are defining what is a sequential logic. But here, when you read this, sequential logic circuits are generally termed as two state or B stable devices which can have their output or input set in one of two basic states a logic level one or logic level zero, and we remain latched, hence the name latch. Uh, and definitely in this current state or condition until some other input trigger pulse or signals is applied to which will cause the be stable to change its state once again. This is not a definition of a, a sequential logic. This is a definition of, of, of a latch. The latch is defined like this. Yeah. Yeah, this is the definition of a latch. A latch is a particular... Uh, Yes, it's a sequential, uh, sequential logic, but it's a particular, in particular, it's not the, 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 the global definition of uh, sequential logic. Sequential logic is not defined like that. This definition yeah. is about large. It's not about uh, sequential logic in this part, in this part. So, uh, should I uh, remove the yes, you have definition to, of large? You have to and put yes. logic. Uh, no. can, can you repeat again, yeah. please? I said should I uh, remove the definition of the large and put the sequential logic definition, or uh, just put the uh, the, the both? The uh, the definition. You don't, uh, uh, after I read after I read your uh, this passage, you don't need to uh, define a large here. A large, a large is a special, is a special kind of memories, and we have many memories. Uh, actually, you didn't talk about memories here. You have a large, we have uh, flip flip flops, we have uh, what's kind, we have yes. uh, we have we have many kind of uh, of memories. You don't need to add this. This is particular. This is particular. This is uh, only one kind. Of, between many. You can't talk about one and uh, don't talk about the others. You, ha you have to, uh, to remove that. You have to remove that and uh, add the new uh, and uh, replace it by yes. the definition of a sequential logic. Okay, we have this diagram, it's very good. And we have here, for instance, uh, you have uh, the, la the next uh, remark, you have always to make a connection between the text and the figure by referencing the figure. This is a very important, this is a very important remark. Each figure, yes. 
For instance, this one, figure one, two. You have to talk about this figure inside sure. uh, your paragraphs. You have to add this reference. You have to uh, talk about it. You can say, for instance, uh, we have uh, the definition of our sequential logic like this and like that. And after, uh, you add like described in figure one, two. This is pr primordial. You, okay. have, you have to add this for all your figures. The figures can't be yes. detached from the, the text. The text and the figures should be always be connected. Should be always be connected for each figure or table, even tables. Yes, yes, I got you. Okay, they should be referenced. Okay. Uh, if we go, for instance, in page four, the ASIC design. ASIC design, what do we have here? Uh, you yes. have to glue the same, uh, the same, same remark. Same. You have to glue the three paragraphs. They are talking about yes. the same subject. These three paragraphs should be uh, should be reassembled together. Should be assembled together because it, it, this is the same. Uh, this is the same. They, they talk about the same thing. You don't need to, to make separation. You don't need to make separation. A paragraph uh, have a big idea. If you are on the same idea, you have to continue your paragraph. You cut. The paragraph and pass to the next when you uh, begin another idea another idea okay we have here this paragraph is actually composed yes. of one sentence it is too small for this one too this one is too small this paragraph is too small recently uh, vlc smos has played a critical role in placing millions of transistors on a single ship Provide the digital system engineers with an ability to implement a vast number of gates with a complex functionality on NASIC ICE. This is too small to uh, compose a paragraph. You have to. Yes, I will explain more. You have to explain more, or you, ha you can add it with the last one. Whatever you want to do. Anyway, you can't. Uh, Fine. Hmm? Which one should I add it? You can add it to the previous one. Like uh, it was expensive components cost and assembly cost. Mm. This one. Uh, the the previous okay. one. Uh, yes. Combine okay. multiple or the or the or the, or the next one or the next one modern AZ combine multiple complex block in a single. You can uh, you can glue them. You can glue the two. You can do it. Okay. The next remark. Okay. Uh, the next remark is about uh, uh, you have to describe a non comment element, like for instance, PLL. Uh, non comment uh, element, the element that not, they are not obvious for the readers. Uh, in our case, uh, our readers are uh, computer scientists. Is that from a Computer scientists. For a, a computer scientist, if you say PLL, yeah. uh, the, the computer di didn't know what, what is a PLL. For an electronician, for instance, uh, he can understand what is a PLL. But for a computer scientist, uh, he has no clue what is a PLL, what is ADC. What is ADC? ADC, I guess, is it, uh, it is analog yes. digital converter. I know that, personally, I know yeah. that because I am in the, uh, I work with that. But for a, a normal uh, computer scientist, uh, he don't know that. You have to explain that. You have to explain those terms. ADC uh, between parentheses, we can add, for instance, analog, analog to digital. So she did converter, converter, converter. PLL the same, PLL the same. 
and uh, OTP. I don't know. I don't, don't even uh, knows what is OTP. Rom, Ram, Ipram. You don't have to do that for those. The Ram and Ram they are well known for computer science. OTP. I don't know what is OTP. Yes. Okay. I forget about it. I, uh, uh, I have written them all. Okay. Okay, you have to add it. Huh? Yeah. I will uh, explain. Yes. The, the idea is this. Yeah, this is uh, an important point here. You can't put something that is not that the uh, the reader cannot understand it. This is the idea of the the thesis, the reduction. You can't add, you cannot add a point in your reduction that the reader can't understand it. You have to explain each aspect of your reduction. Okay. Okay, I will explain. Okay, now we uh, go to the page five. In page five, we have, for instance, here specification of the ship. The specification engineer define the characteristic, microarchitecture, function, specification, and design. Uh, those parts also they are they are too small. They are too small. We have we have a, this paragraph specification of the ship in two lines. We have this one in two lines. We have the next one in three lines or four lines. Uh, the next one, two lines, two lines. They, they, they are not suited, uh, suited to be uh, presented like paragraphs. They should be used, you use it like a bullet text. You know what is a bullet text? The bullet text is this. This is the bullet text. You have to see, this is the bullet text. Like this. Like points. Yes. Like this. But because they are too small, they are too small to be defined as a, a specific uh, sections. They are declared like sections. Section one one four. Uh, sorry, four one one, uh, four one two, four one three. They'll be, they be. They, they should be declared like yeah. uh, like bullet points. Uh, we have this too. We have to continue yes. in the in the section four point one point five. You have bees. Say the same thing. Bees. I can't understand what uh, what, uh, what uh, does that mean. What is bees? You have uh, at least to give the acronym. What is the acronym? Bees. For instance, B means something. I means uh, uh, is the signification of another word. Yes. 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 This is what you call acronym. You have at least to give the reader the acronym. The acronym. And the same for ATPG. What is ATPG? You have to add the acronym. I don't know. A, uh, what is T, and what is P, etc., etc. You have to explain each word uh, of the acronym. Okay, uh, uh, for in page, uh, we, we are in page 7, in page 7, in page 7, uh, section uh, 5.1.1, this is the same problem, those uh, uh, sections are too small to be, to be considered like uh, sections. They have to be uh, changed to bullet points. Can you see that? Um, yes, yes. They are too small. They are too small. Yes. We continue. If we go, for instance, to page eight. In page eight, we have uh, the ASIC designer. Versus FPGA design. This is not important. Normally, yeah, the, the, the proper way to uh, to write it is ASIC versus FPGA design. I know that I was me the, who wrote that. Yeah. Yes, but it was just uh, a draft. 
It was just uh, an explanation. But the, the proper way to write on, on a thesis, uh, it should be ASIC versus FPGA design. You have to... ASIC versus FPGA design, design, like this. Like this. Okay. It was just a draft from me. Uh, but the proper way to talk, the proper way to write uh, in, uh, in thesis is, uh, is like this. It's uh, this way. Okay, I will change it to ASIC versus FPGA design. Design. Uh, we have the next point. Uh, the main difference between these two uh, architectures. Uh, this, uh, the, the, the term architectures is not appropriate here. The term architectures. Technology is, is more appropriate. The, yes. the, the ASIC and FPGA are not uh, architectures, they are technologies. Okay. Oh, do you understand me? Yeah. Yes. 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 I understand. Yes. Very good. I will replace the the word architectures to to technologies with, uh, or other technology. technology. Uh, yes, or other uh, whatever you want, but they are not architectures in the proper sense of the term. Okay. If you continue, for instance, for six point yes. one, uh, we have design flexibility. Same here. The same problem. They are too small to be uh, considered. Uh, like sections, they are too small. You have to use a bullet. Yes, I will do, do them like that. Okay, very good, very good. Uh, let's continue. We have in a computer architecture definition. In the definition, what do we have here? Uh, is the references a uh, like we see here? Digital logic, Where? Uh, level macro architecture, instruction, level operating system, and assembly language. Uh, I need to know this resource. I'm not sure about that in the definition. The, uh, for instance, operating system is not considered part of the architecture. I don't know. Maybe you get... Uh, I need to check this reference to, uh, to, to, to see if it misunderstood or uh, it's something I don't know, maybe I'm, uh, I'm wrong, but I need a reference of this. From where we, uh, you get this? Who said that? Who said that? Do you understand me? This yes, yes, I got you. Yeah. I didn't uh, uh, references, but I will send you. Okay, you, you have, uh, I, we'll talk about the, uh, the, the references later. You ha we have to add the reference. Uh, I will send you the reference of this uh, paragraph. Okay, very good, very good. Uh, and we have yes. here, for instance, the three primary categories of computer architecture components are, uh, are those, those parts. Those parts, uh, it's uh, in this situation, in this situation, particular situation, maybe we are in definition. In the definition, maybe uh, you need to write, to synthesize, to synthesize a, a, a paragraph. It's better than, uh, than a bullet point. It's much more better because we are in definition. Definition, we are with. <laughs> you, you understand that. The, the bullet point, like we have, uh, like we have, uh, there are some circumstances, uh, some situations when bullet, point, bullet points are preferable than reduction. But in this particular situation, the, the, the reduction is preferable. You have to explain, you have to write. You have to write. Uh, yes. We, we have this part in the next one. <coughs> the same here. For definition of uh, the microarchitecture, uh, it's uh, yes. generally, generally in definitions when we, when you are defining something, uh, you need to write. You don't need to add the points. You need to uh, explain uh, each part uh, in a proper paragraph. In a proper paragraph, 
you, 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 it's preferable. It's, you are not obliged to do that. It's not, a, it's not a big deal. It's not a big problem. But the, the, the best way, it's correct. I mean, this is correct. You, you don't need uh, to change it. But it's preferable to write a paragraph here, to synthesize a paragraph. Paragraph because why? Because we are in definition section. We are defining. We are de when we are defining, uh, the preferable is to write. Is write a paragraph, a proper paragraph. Yes. Uh, in this point, system level design. This system level design means other thing. That uh, uh, this uh, system level design choices regarding peripheral like memory controllers and their Prefer, uh, performance yeah. level and level. I, I think you did a mistake here. This is not what is uh, what meant of uh, system level design. System level design is another thing. I don't know. You have to check your uh, references or, but uh, I think the system level design is a design methodology. I don't know. We are you are talking about the peripheral here. I I I, I, I can't understand what's uh, what the uh, the deal here. But I think those yes. uh, they, they are not connected. This is not the, uh, the, the, the you are not talking about the system level the design right. here. And uh, the system level design doesn't have a, his place here. It's not used. The, the the system level design. It's not a component of a, a microarchitecture. The system level design, it's a methodology of design. It's like uh, in uh, when, uh, when doing software, you have some methodologies like Meris yes. or, uh, I don't remember, Meris or, uh, you have some uh, well-known uh, EML, EML, they are methodologies. They are not components. System level design also, it's a methodology. You understand that? It's not a component of microarchitecture. There is something not uh, correct here. I don't know where. You have to check that. You have to check this, uh, this part. So should I remove the system level design decisions or not? I don't know. I don't know if, uh, how did you, where did you get that? I need to check the reference, the same here. I need to check the reference. Who said that? Who said that the system level design is a part of a micro architecture? You have, you have to okay. check it or you have to make the reference to, uh, to verify that. You have to verify this information. I don't remember that. This is, uh, this, this is not compatible. Yes, I will check that. Okay, very uh, good. Reference and then we see. Okay, very good. Uh, in the next page, in page uh, 10, uh, we have here, same here, it's preferable to formulate a small paragraph instead of using bullets. The same, in definitions, uh, those two bullets uh, could be uh, preferably uh, transformed to, uh, to a paragraph. Same here. Yes. Yeah. The, the the preference. It's not a problem. Yes. The the bullets, the bullets are generally used to enumerate multiple multiple uh, differences. But in this case, we uh, say the same here. You, you need to express. You need to to express a paragraph to uh, to talk about those uh, three comp two components or three components. Okay, the next one, in page uh, uh, 11, characteristic, you have to ask something. Uh, in, in, in section 4.1.1, here you have uh, to add some text here. You can't uh, start uh, directly with the bullets. With, the, with the point, yes. Yes, you have to, to add something. You have to add something. You have to say, for instance, characteristics. We have different characteristics concerning uh, them. Uh, we are talking about uh, uh, the hardware architecture. 
concerning the hardware, the hardware architecture, we can enumerate them like this, like follow. And you, you, uh, you put your uh, your characteristic. You, the first one uses uh, separate memory, etc., etc., etc. You have to add something here. Uh, the next one, you have appli yes. application for uh, uh, four point one port two. Same here. You have to add some text here. You have to add some text. And I guess the same. Yes, and the same thing for uh, on human architecture. Uh, yes, very good. For others, characteristics, applications. Uh, yes, there are many situations when you can't start directly with a bullet. You have to add some text. Yes. Uh, okay, in part five, in uh, section five, uh, risk versus risk. We have here, what do you mean yeah. by search results? Here, th th this is an expression. I didn't understand this expression. You have here are the key differences between risk and sys based on the previous research results. What do you mean by previous research results? I think it's a mistake. Yes, it's not clear. Uh, we don't have any research here. I, I think you should remove that. You should remove that. Previous research based based on the previous results should be removed. The, sen the sentence should be removed. Okay. Okay, we'll continue. We have a 5.1.1. Risk reduced instruction set computer. This is a considered like a section. You have to write the paragraph here. Yes. Okay, I will introduce something that. Yeah, you can't. You can't let, 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 let it empty like this. This is empty uh, section. This is an empty section. You have uh, to talk about what is risk before you go to uh, its characteristics. You have uh, to define or describe. Uh, or talk uh, a little about risk and uh, go to the next uh, uh, to next section. And the same here, you have to add some text here. You can't start directly by bullets. Yes. Same here, advantages. Disadvantages, you have to add some text. Uh, yes. 5.2. You have to add a paragraph here. It's an empty section. You can't uh, create an empty section like this. And the same for, for yes. okay. 5.2.1. The same for 5.2.2. And the uh, same for 5.2.3. Uh, yes. Uh, in uh, in section six point one, single instruction stream, single data stream. Uh, same here. Instruction. This section is uh, constituted you have to from the board. only by bullets. You have to write a paragraph. Uh, you have to understand one thing, one important thing. The main uh, constituent yes. of your uh, thesis are the paragraphs. The bullets uh, can extend a paragraph. Do you understand? But, but the, main, uh, the main component is the paragraph. The first thing to do is, is writing a paragraph. paragraph. Uh, if you put a bullet instead of writing a paragraph, it's not, uh, it's not good. It's not uh, a good practice. Uh, do you understand? Yes. Me? Should I uh, remove the right paragraph or just add the paragraph at uh, the first and uh, let the two points? Oh, no, in this in this uh, in this section, uh, you need to write a paragraph upon uh, upon these two ideas. You have to. Okay. Uh, yeah. Yes. You have to. You have to synthesize a paragraph upon these two uh, two bullets. Yes. Okay, the same here. A paragraph is a suited 
uh, more sweated than bullets. Uh, you can, uh, the the the, uh, the 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 idea is here. You can't replace bullets by a paragraph. The paragraph is the main component. Yeah. Okay. Okay. The same for uh, six point three. Yes, Sa and the same for six point four. Six point four. Okay, and we finished. And we finished. Uh, yes. I will talk. Uh, yes. Excuse me. The references uh, I didn't send it to you, like. I let them at the end of the, the thesis. Yes, very good. You have, uh, and uh, do you know the format on how to add uh, the, uh, the references? It's very important. The references should be, uh, should follow what we call, uh, you can see, for, for instance, this, uh, this thesis. The references are yeah. fo following the standard. If you see here, you have to add the brackets a number, the number of uh, reference, and at the yes. end you have to add. This is this is what we call. It's it's automatically done by uh, LaTeX. LaTeX can do that automatically. Do you know? Yes, that? LaTeX uh, do these uh, things automatically, Auto not like the word. Yeah, very good, very good. Because the, it is a standard. It is a standard. You have to write the author, the uh, the name of the authors, the title of the paper. And the journal and the, the university, etc., uh, etc. Et Let, let's take an example. Yes. This section is very important on how to write the references. It's very important. We can see, for instance, this. Uh, this is the reference section. This is the reference yes. section. We can see, for, yes. for instance, we have first the author's name. The author's name. One. Uh, we have the title. Of the document, the title. In this instance, yeah. Notrino Technic Library. And we have, uh, in this uh, particular uh, case, it is a website. We have the website. And you can. Okay. okay. Yeah. Uh, yes, and the same for the book, for, for the books, for the scientific papers, for the technical reports, for the uh, encyclopedia. For instance, uh, encyclopedia for dictionaries. Uh, they are they are all uh, they are should they should uh, all uh, follow some kind of standard, some kind of a way of uh, writing uh, the references. The, 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 the references are very important. You have to write the references uh, from now. They, they, we don't let uh, we don't yeah. uh, write uh, the references. Uh, at the end, from now, uh, we give us the time to see the references, to check if they are good or not. Uh, if you took some text from a particular document, you have to reference it. Uh, otherwise, yeah. it's considered like a plagia. You have yeah, like... Uh, it's it's mentioned like my, my plagiarism check gave me near. Yes. Like five, uh, yeah. Like fifty percent, but but, but see, uh, I would put. Yeah, talk because. About that. Yeah, because I didn't uh, mention the references. This is why. Uh, but even though, even though you should synthesize, you have the the, the references. You have to take the idea, the ideas. Yeah. And you have to uh, synthesize by yourself. Yes. You. If yes. Uh, in some situations, in some particular situations, you can uh, quote the definitions. In the definitions, for instance, uh, like uh, for instance, the the definition of a risk, a risk uh, architecture. A risk architecture is defined, for instance, in an, an encyclopedia, like this. And you write the text of the definition between codes, and you add the uh, and you add the reference at the end. You yes. Have, this is this is uh, a, a copy, uh, a, a perfect copy of the text. 
But in the general case, you have to sensitize, you have to write. The, the, uh, the way to write a chapter is to take multi sources, for instance, let, let's take an example. Let's take an example. For instance, the uh, let's talk about FPGA for instance. You have, for instance, three documents. You read the one, the first document. Then you read the second. Then you read the third. You have to choose some ideas from the first one, the second one, the third one. You have, for instance, choose to write about five ideas, five points. You have many points, you have to uh, neglect, you have to neglect some points. They are not uh, interesting for your writing, for instance, for your chapter. You take five points and you have to synthesize, uh, you have to write by yourself. And it's not difficult, it's not difficult. It's just normal speaking, it's just normal speaking. You don't need to be fancy in writing. The, the, you don't need to use, uh, I don't know, uh, sophisticated talking or sophisticated English. In the contrary, you have to take a small, uh, sorry, a simple, simple way of writing. Yes. This is scientific writing. This is what we call a scientific writing. The sophisticated, complicated writing is the literal writing. This is not for good for the scientific writing. The scientific writing should be uh, simple, clear, and very easy to understand. You have just you have your five points. You just need to talk about the five points you can, uh, directly, directly with, with, uh, without using a fancy word or complicated word. This is the yes. this is what we call the synthesis. This is the synthesis. Don't you understand the synthesis? And it's a bit of a good mission, but it's a little bit of a good No, so my hand is easy. They tell them and family document is there. Tell them what I want to take them on break. Take them on break. You can go look at a sedisa. Like a sample. Mara who said this. And they will think I said that. See, for some of the bush and a look, you know, the plagia. The plagia was a machine problem of leading. The problem of the kids about the kids, but the machine is the material. It has any leading. So I'm telling you, she is the kids about. فهمت كيفاه؟ زعما علي دوكيمون تهز الافكار بصح ما تقدرش تهز لي زيدي اه سوري تهز الافكار بصح ما تقدرش تهز الكتبه فهمت كيفاه؟ هذه هي الفكره هذا هو الكبر وكيما نقولوا سي سي اوبليغاتوار زعما كي تحك السينكيام ماني لازم تتعلم تكتب على بالي بلي سي با فاسيل على بالك حنا كيما في لاكولتور تاعنا حنا في وسمو في ليديوكاسيون تاعنا ما نكتبوش بزاف ما نريديجيوش بزاف Ça c'est faux, c'est pas pour rédiger, c'est important, c'est important. La rédaction, c'est une question habituelle, Barak. C'est pas, pas difficile. À faire le wolf, Barak, c'est pas quelque chose de compliqué. Parce que, comme on dit, on a des gens qui ont des gens normal. Par exemple, quand on a des gens qui ont des gens qui ont des gens qui ont des gens qui ont des gens qui C'est la même chose, c'est exactement la même chose. ثم كيما نقولوا كيما نقولوا ما تيماجينيهاش كيما نقولوا كيما نقولوا الكتابه تاع شيكسبير ولا سي با دو شيكسبير حنا سي سيونتيفيك حنا نمد اكزاكت حنا نمد لو بلو سامبل بوسيبل نمد ابسط كيما نقولوا كتابه ممكنه باه يفهمها الأكبر عدد من من القراء اه خلاص دوك نولي ندير هاك اي سي سا كيما نقولوا لا سينتيز اون ابيل سا لا سينتيز سا سي لا سينتيز ذيس از ذا ايديا اوف ذا سينتيز Yes. Uh, uh, the reference, we talked about the reference. Uh, I have to explain something about uh, the introduction and the conclusion. Yes. The introduction is very good. It's uh, written in uh, a very sweet English. L let's, say, let's say this, in a very sweet uh, English, but there are some rules uh, to write a correct introduction. The, uh, the introduction has a specific job in a chapter. The, the introduction and the conclusion, they are a particular job. The, uh, the first thing, uh, you, in the introduction you have uh, two main points, uh, sorry, three, we can, we can uh, say two or three. Point to, to remember, 
when uh, writing an introduction of a chapter. The first one, the first idea of uh, an introduction is to give the context. To give the context. When writing an introduction, we have to give the context of our chapter. What is the context? The term, the word context, uh, is the uh, is the explanation is the uh, how can I explain that? This is the way to explain the reader which part of science we are talking about. Uh, for instance, for instance. In this chapter, we are talking about uh, digital design and computer architecture. The, the, uh, the reader is a computer scientist. The reader is a computer yes. scientist. You need uh, to explain uh, which part of computer, scientist, uh, science, uh, computer science this chapter belongs to. For instance, computer, the digital design, computer architecture, we are talking about uh, the hardware part of the computer science. It's not about software here. Yes, it's and all about the It's the hardware. hardware. It's the hardware. And you have to precise that in the introduction. You have to, this is the context. The context, you have to explain which category, which part of uh, science this chapter belongs to. Which, which uh, it's, it's, it's all about the classification. We know that we have many disciplines in the computer science. In the introduction, you have to explain exactly which part of computer science this chapter belongs to. This is what we call the context. The context is you give the reader the uh, which kind, which uh, classification, which part of the uh, this chapter belong in the map of computer science. In computer science, we have many disciplines. We have to precise which discipline this chapter belong. This is the context. This is what we call the context. Uh, you have to give the, the, sense, the, the second thing is, the, is to give the idea, the idea of your chapter, the, of your chapter. For instance, in this part, you are talking about digital design, computer architecture. This is what you explained here. You explained the idea. Then uh, technology, uh, the, the digital design and computer architecture serves as a uh, bedrock of modern uh, computer, etc. etc. This is the idea. This is what you call second. This is the idea of the chapter. This is the idea of the chapter. This is what you did. This is what you did. And the last uh, thing, the third point, you have to give this globally, globally the structure of the chapter. You have to say this chapter, this chapter starts with, uh, for instance, the, the, the digital design part section, the section digital design. Then we will talk about, uh, briefly, yeah, and we will talk about the computer architecture. You have to give, uh, briefly, the structure of the chapter, of the chapter. We have many things here, you have to give an overview, a small overview, in a three or two lines of the global structure of the chapter. We have these three points in the introduction, and we have two points in the conclusion. We have two other points to, uh, to give in the conclusion. The first one, the conclusion, should be a resume. Resume. Should be a uh, conclusion should be uh, something uh, that uh, in uh, a small number of lines uh, resume all the chapter. This is what you did here. The chapter, uh, in this chapter, the, uh, the symbiotic relationship between digital design, this is what you did here. This is uh, yes. a summary. This is not. This is what you call exactly a summary. This is a summary about the chapter. But you have to add another thing. You have to talk about 
the main part of the shatta. You have it's not uh, like the introduction. It's not a structure of the, the chapter, but the main point, the main important point of the chapter that concern our uh, th thesis. For instance, uh, in our uh, in our uh, work, in our work, what we need to do, we need to create uh, a processor. You have to talk about the important uh, point about that. For instance, you can say in this chapter we saw uh, we saw uh, the important uh, we saw what is uh, the combinational circuit and what is a sequencer circuit. Uh, these two are the main components of the digital design. This is an important point. Uh, you can say, yeah. for instance, yes. Do you have questions? No, I don't. Yes, uh, you have to add that. You have the to add the main uh, important point uh, to remember in this chapter. Why uh, to remember to remember this is this is about all the th the thesis, all the work we, we are working uh, on this new architecture. You have to see what are the main points that can help us in the next of uh, the global work of the global thesis. You yes. Know? Yes. Th this is some rules uh, to know when you are writing a thesis you have some particular rules to know about writing a thesis yes i understand okay i guess we finished you have to do some modifications for this chapter yes yes i guess this is it this is it do you have questions or uh, about the chapter two. Chapter two, yes. Should I add the references or? Yes, uh, no? yes, yes, of course. We will add references on each chapter. I need to verify the, the references. We uh, the, uh, the we will check the references uh, before the final step. Before the final step, it would be okay. Uh, yes, you have to add references to, to to check them. I need to check them. Uh, even even the format, if you are writing correctly, the the format of the uh, of the references. Yeah. Yes, of course. Yes. Yes. Yes, it's important. Yes, it's important to add references. Did you start the the writing of the chapter two? Yes, I start. Okay. Did you get some difficulties, or it's easy? No. Uh, at these points, there is no difficulties. Okay. Good. Very good. Very good. Yes. Do you have other questions? Uh, no. Okay. I will I will make the changes of the chapter one, and I will uh, resend it to you. Okay. Okay. Yes. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. Well, it's I will, yes, I will stop here. Barakallahu Shukran, Barakallahu fiik. Salam alaikum. Salam alaikum.